What's up, everyone? If you've recently purchased a pair of stocking foot waders, you're probably now on the hunt for the perfect pair of wading boots. Acquiring suitable outerwear is a vital part of fishing that is often overlooked, and finding a great pair of wading boots is a small but important step in being comfortable as well as maintaining your own safety in the water. There are a number of options on the market, which makes it difficult to choose the best one. In this video, we compiled a list of the top 5 best wading boots on the market today. Be sure to watch till the end for our best recommendation. If you want more information or updated pricing on the products mentioned here, check out the links in the description below. If you have another product you'd like us to review, let us know by leaving a comment down below. So without further ado, let's get started. First we have Best Sims Wading Boots, Sims G3 Guide Wading Boots. These have a couple of different features, including dual density midsoles for shock absorption in the face of uncertain terrain. They also have a good amount of ankle support with their top to toe lacing system, which offers not only a customized fit, but an added element of risk protection. They also include a full scratch rubber rand for added durability. Their pros are, they're versatile, they're comfortable to wear all day long, and they feature River Tread, a way to give anglers more feeling underfoot without compromising traction. However, they're spendy, and their sizes tend to be a little tight. Bottom line is, they're the best Sims wading boots on our list. They have waterproof nubuck leather and textile upper with top toe lacing. And they have TPU heel counters and clips for maximized ankle support. Next we have Best Wading Boots for Slippery Rocks, Orvis Encounter Wading Boots. The upper of these boots is made completely of synthetic material in an effort to reduce water absorption. It includes a rubber heel and toe cap for scratch resistance. The collars are padded for added ankle support and comfort, and the inner boot is also created for comfort with the help of sponge cushioning. Their pros are, they're attractive and stylish, they're comfortable and stable, and they provide great traction and strong currents. However, the felt soles are banned in some states and the sponge cushioning absorbs water and keeps it there. Bottom line is, they're the best wading boots for slippery rocks. They have scratch-resistant rubber toe caps with fully lined interior, and their durable felt sole offers exceptional grip over slippery surfaces. Next we have Best Fly Fishing Wading Boots, Corker's Greenback Wading Boots. This pair of wading boots comes with Klingon rubber soles if you prefer not to use felt soles. To reduce the weight from waterlogged boots, Corkers uses a drainage system that allows water to flow through the internal channels and out through midsole ports. They are high quality shoes and definitely don't lose points in terms of design and comfort. Their pros are, they're easy to get off and on, not too stiff. Their interchangeable soles allow for personalization and their great drainage system keeps the boots light and comfortable in the water. However, the felt soles harbor invasive species more than rubber soles, and putting the soles back on after changing them takes some work. Bottom line is, they're the best fly fishing wading boots on our list. They include plain felt and Klingon sticky rubber interchangeable soles, and they have effective drainage and are coated with hydrophobic material for water resistance. Next we have Best Saltwater Wading Boots – For Everlast Reef Boots these are constructed with a hard sole bottom for traction. The body of the boot has four layers of vulcanized rubber, which is meant to provide protection from potential hazards in saltwater settings, like sharp reefs or jagged underwater structures. These boots are a great option for saltwater anglers who are looking for some added protection in and out of the water. Their pros are, they are easy to slip on and off, they grip a variety of underwater surfaces very well, and the nice quality material holds up well to pricks and pokes from reef structures. However, they're heavy, they're not stylish, and they're not always true to size. Bottom line is, they're the best saltwater wading boots on our list. They have a patented boot design with zipper and an adjustable Velcro, and they have a cleated and reinforced sole for better grip and lasting comfort. Finally, we have best wading boots, Sims Freestone Wading Boots. They provide support in two important places, underfoot with a good amount of rubber traction and in the ankle with added ankle support. This combines in a great blend of risk prevention and slip resistance. They're comfortable, durable, and will keep you out of trouble when it comes to slick riverbeds. Their pros are, their good amount of traction prevents hazards, they're made with high quality durable materials, and they're very comfortable and easy to wear for hours at a time. 
however, they're a little heavy. The cleat studs for extra traction are an additional cost, and sizing isn't always consistent with regular shoe sizes. Bottom line is, they're durable wading boots made from waterproof synthetic leather and rubber. Their dual-density EVA midsoles absorb shock and deliver comfort, and their right-angle footbed technology prevents foot fatigue. There you have it, our top 5 best wading boots on the market. Check out the links in the description below for detailed information and latest pricing. If you thought this video was helpful, please smash that like button and consider subscribing. If you didn't, let me know why in the comments below. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.